Welcome back, my friends, to another rousing rendition. I left the door open so the dogs are joining us, so it'll be a brief one. They like barking at the squirrels farting, so I'll let them out because there's other dogs out back they want to argue with. So, 22 veterans a day in this country commit suicide. We bring it up every time, and I say this every time, and I'll keep saying it every time. If you don't, if you don't like hearing it, then don't watch the channel, because that's what's on our heart, and that's what's on our mind. And vets, we love you. You fought for us. Let us fight for you. All I can do is raise awareness. That's it, because I got no answers. I don't pretend to. It's way out of my scope, but I do love you, and I am, am thankful for you. We back the blue here. How you do that, Scab? Well, we don't break the damn law best we can. Now, sometimes I say that, and I turn around and break out something legal. So, the best we can, we don't break the law, but we do we do support our Leos, our law enforcement officers. And finally, if you are an addict, never quit quitting. It'll take one time, it'll stick one time, you just gotta want it to. Now, this is gonna be like a fast, like a five minute deal. It's a what's in your pocket. We're gonna do those just about every day that we can. Uh, some days with the schedule up and down, you know, I, I'd rather be more consistent and do the what's in your pocket in the morning and the review in the afternoon. Uh, life don't always work the way we want it, does it? So, we're working nights again tonight. Um, it, it's starting to get a little old, but you do what you do and you do what you have to do. The thing that skips on, because somebody says, well, I've done it for years. Good for you, so did I. I don't want to do it for years. The thing that gets old is to go in one day, you're in the morning, the next day, you're at night. Shit just gets old. Anyway, neither here nor there. I'm very thankful to have a job and, and all that crap that you say. So, Scab, what's in your pocket? Well, what I'm going to carry today is we're just going to go back hardcore basic right here, son. The PM2 S35VN. Heck of a work knife. Heck of a knife in general. I love my paramilitary too. It's beat up. You can see the blade beat up. It's all beat up, but it's a dang good knife. Um, that's that's a staple. And then the other thing that I am going to carry um, tonight is is the Medford. Um, it's a big, heavy knife, and I can do anything with this knife. Is it a fixed blade? I, it might as well be. I mean, because it it can you can use it for anything uh, that you need to. And I just like having a good, solid, reliable. Um, and the PM2 is. And, and the cold steels are, but I, I really like having this on me. Um, feels good in the pocket and all that. So those are the, the part of what I carry. Y'all know I carry four uh, pocket knives. Do I use them all? No. Uh, every now and then I'll throw one at a homeless guy or say, you know, if he steals my peanut butter and jelly, no, I'm not over it. No, I'm not getting over it. I know it's Christmas. I'm going to make a bunch of sandwiches and take them out there. Because it would be just me and Megan at Christmas time. Kind of sad, don't you think? All right. Now, the fixed blade that I'm using for today is I'm going away from the preacher a little bit for today um, just just because I'm doing, you know, the Medford. I do have the Russia, and I do have, you know, the PM2. And, and so sometimes pocket knives get heavy, so we're going to go a little lighter. Plus, again, downtown in front of Baptist Hospital, you know, uh, Sometimes you get a little sideways look. Of course, you don't get many sideways looks at two in the damn morning uh, because you're freezing to death. But the, the fixed plate I'm going with today is is one of my favorites. This is a CRKT, the Rockasant. Now, I think we went over this a while ago. I'm not sure. This may be the Persian. I don't know. And you know what? I don't care. It's the Rockasant. 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 The rock song. I love it. I love the old school look. I just I, I took this one from Kirk or he gave it to me or something happened in there where I wound up with it. Um, Grippy G10. It's pinned in there. It's full tang. Gotta have that full tang construction with some sweet tea. So there, no. Uh, yeah, it is full tang. And I just like the blade. It reminds me of an old old blade that my granddad, one of my first fixed blades, my granddaddy ever gave me. Is reminiscent of this, and it's got the it's got the nice clip point. It's got the recurve, and let me let me just say this, guys. I know that everybody that watches this channel is a damn knife aficionado expert knows everything. I, I know that, but there are a couple younger guys that watch it 
who, who haven't been blessed with, with knowing everything in the world like many of you have. So to those young men, let me say, guys, in, in looking for a fixed blade, especially starting out, that recurves a good little bonus because it does, it can help you cheat a little bit on some cutting. I like to recurve. Now, somebody asked me every day, Scab, why do you not ever show a knife with serrations? Because I don't own any. I, I don't like them. It's a personal thing. Um, and, and if somebody, and they well, you know, if you're deployed, well, if I was deployed or, or, you know, stuck on a desert island, I might consider some serrations. Uh, but I'm neither. So I don't like serrations. So this is the Rakasan. This is what I'm going with them for my fixed blade. Now, I am doing a video on this today, good Lord willing, and I don't run out of time, but just keep on talking. The other thing I'm going to throw in the truck with me, and it's going to be part of the video this afternoon, or in the morning, no matter how it falls out, is a CRKT Kimbry. Now, this one was designed by Roush. This is a Roush design. It's not a uh, RMJ design. This is a Frankish axe. I took and kind of, uh, I took a little Dremel and radius, you know, it's a square handle. You know, and if I say I don't like it, well, I would love it. I don't know why you don't like it, Scab. Because, you know why you like it? Because I don't. So I radiused it. Um, and then my guy, Sean Crawford, did all my, did all my uh, work in there. It's got, the verse on the back is, says, I put a verse on there, Sean did, which he did a jam up job. The revenger of blood himself shall slay the murderer. When he meeteth him, he shall slay him. So you may not want to meeteth me if I got this. You know what I'm saying? Especially if you kill somebody. Well, that's all the fun time we got for this video. I love you guys. God bless you guys. Um, I hope that you're probably getting off work now by the time this loads up. So I hope you've had a good work day. It's Christmas week, so Merry Christmas, Feliz Navidad, and good Lord willing. Now, if I don't get a cutting video out today, I want to, but if I don't, I will release in the morning. And and, and the deal's going to be this, guys. Um, my mom and dad usually leave. Uh, they're, they're leaving Christmas Eve to go up to my mama's people's and Meg's people's in Detroit. And my son's over in Bama, so it's just going to be me and mama here this weekend. So we're probably... Gonna, I'm probably going to put out a ton of cutting videos, things like that. Uh, it'd be Christmas time with Scab. What more could you want? So I love y'all. God bless y'all. I'm Scab. You're not. And we gone.